welcome back to my channel so let's get started first off i start my face wash my perfect and radiant media face wash you can use this as a scrub as a face wash as a mask so i'm just gonna use it as a mask today you're going to see me spread it around my face and i'll let it dry for at least five to ten minutes give or take So guys, we're done. I rinsed up, and next I'm going in with my serum. This is my hyaluronic acid serum. You're gonna see me put it into the bottle because guys, the bottle has finished. But I can't let it go. I have to squeeze every last drop. That's how good the serum is. So you're gonna watch me struggle a bit. <laughs> finally was able to squeeze out quite a few drops which I maximized white also guys when applying hyaluronic acid make sure your face is wet make sure to use water because hyaluronic acid dries out your face so here I'm just gonna put a little bit of water on my fingertips and I'm going to watch me massage it in to my face You also want to let that dry whenever I apply your products you want to allow it to dry first before going on with any other products that are always smudging products together so next I use my hyaluronic acid gel eye patches I'm using this immediately after my hyaluronic acid because I mean there's still good hyaluronic acid so they look like this and they have a very in effect so I gently place this under my eye for 15 to 20 minutes this also helps to avoid dark circles spots under the eyes puffy eyes it has it honestly has so many benefits and it sparkles so you have a sparkling around the house while using it So guys, I'm done and I'm gonna move into my serum. I use the natural vitamin C serum. This contains a lot, which you guys can see there. I apply this mostly in the mornings and I apply the hyaluronic acid at night, but today I wasn't really going anywhere and I mean it's a skincare thing, so I decided to apply them all for you guys to see. This has a lot of benefits. It helps to tone my skin. It helps to brighten my skin. You must have a vitamin C serum in your skincare routine if you want a really healthy skin. So I just gently, if you notice, guys, I'm not rubbing it harshly on my face. I'm gently, you want to gently spread it to your skin and let your skin absorb it gently. I also pat it like Koreans do. I learned a lot of my skincare from Koreans. And baby, look at that glue, guys. Look 
like I'm meaning to do it. I mean, I'm not. The sun is part of it too, but trust me, with or without sun, we glow out here. So don't forget to let it dry. Um, I'm going in with my clean and clear moisturizer. I use this moisturizer a lot because I have, or oh, I used to have blackheads. You know this tiny, tiny stuff that under the skin, I leave black spots at the top. Yeah, I used to have those. And this helped a lot in clearing blackheads. Even the blackhead clear. I also had the cleanser too, which is finished. And I couldn't add it, but I'll leave a picture up here below. The apple roof, sorry, guys. I'll leave a picture up here so you guys can see the cleanser I'm talking about. And yeah, I want to gently massage everything gently so you don't smudge the previous products that you put on before. Also, guys, when moisturizing, moisturize. I see a lot of people moisturizing. You know, they just put it to like moisturize. Take a fair amount, at least when you're moisturizing. You know, you should take at least one finger of products. Make sure to moisturize properly to have a healthy, glowing skin. guys this is my holy grail bio oil guys i kid you not let me put you guys on the bio oil is the best spot clearer like, you want to clear your spot on a budget you don't you don't have money for ordinary and all that blah 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 bio oil guys consistency for at least two to four weeks will give you what you want bio oil clear spots Fades, wrinkles, stretch marks, all that. It has many uses. So I use bio oil on my face morning and night. In the morning, when you're using it, using your sunscreen. At night, you use it before you go to bed. But bio oil, guys, I'm giving you guys my secret. Bio oil. And you don't need too much. That's the good part about it. It's not one of those products that finish fast. You just stick a little on your palm or a little on your face and gently rub it in as you can see a little bit of glow on your face and it helps to give that glow too because I mean it's oil so here you're gonna see me shining like I poured ground oil on my face no skincare routine without your lips so i use vaseline on my lips apart from my usual lip gloss my clear gloss i use vaseline a lot especially at night and a lip max i do a honey and sugar lip scrub i do it myself diy so just mix a little honey and sugar and scrub your lips gently at least two to three times a week and you should be good to go And last but not least, the most important sunscreen. Guys, if you do not use sunscreen, all this has gone to waste. I mean, your whole skincare routine has gone to waste because the sun is not your friend, guys. Especially when using as we products, you know, all these products have active ingredients in them and they're mostly acids. So when you do all this, your skin is glowing and then you head out under the sun. No sunscreen. You're going to be dark. It's going to burn you. You're going to have hyperpigmentation and the whole point is gone. So make sure to apply. And I mean apply. Don't spare your sunscreen. Apply it. This is actually a new sunscreen I got. I was using the SPF 50. Um, I'll leave the picture up below. I've forgotten the name of the sunscreen. But as you can see, I'm generously applying my sunscreen. And what I love about this sunscreen is it gives a glow to your skin. If you notice, it has me glowing. 
I literally glowing. So I'm not. I am glowing. Also, I know you guys notice that spots on the side of my cheek, but that's another reason why you shouldn't pop your pimples. Recently, I saw a very little pimple, guys. Like, if you see how little this pimple is, and I popped it, and the next morning, I'm waking up to a black scar on the side of my face. And it's even faded now before it was so dark. So guys, do not pop pimples, just apply ice to them and yeah, they should be fine. So I'm gently dabbing in my sunscreen. Moisturize your neck. So whatever you do to your face, do to your neck. Because you don't want to have a clear glowing face and your neck is dark and dry. Nah, it doesn't make sense. So I'm dabbing in and yeah. Let me just come in closer so you guys can see the shine, girls. The shine. Glow, baby. So, we've come to the end of this video. And if you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to comment and subscribe. Comment on part of this video you liked. And I'll leave the bullets down for you guys below. If you have any questions to also don't forget to let me know in the comment section below and i'll make sure to film it i'll see you guys in my next video bye